going, yeah, I want one of those, right? <laughs> right. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm very lucky. And yeah. uh, so even then, it took me three years to get out of that, right. you know, because orders keep on coming yeah. in. I wasn't soliciting. Then I went on two painting trips, Tuscany and Provence, and okay. that opened up that whole yes. door box. Yeah. Wow, there's so what much to do. learn. Right. Uh, in painting, you know, values, color theory, all that I yeah. never learned, even right. when I was painting. So, um, okay. yeah, that's how I kind of started. So, so you learned you learned the lettering, I guess, at the sign shop. And uh, anybody remembers lettering? It's before the computers. You actually had to draw it out. Yeah, there was a lot of yeah, process they actually, right uh, to it. They didn't even have stencils or anything. So no. we were basically, uh, the, my main job at the sign shop was uh, designing the signs. Yeah. So... The boss would give his input of what typeface he might want. For, right. He did a lot of submarine shop signs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, we basically went by a letter set book to, okay. uh, to reference and then had to draw the letters full size by hand, by eye. <laughs> <laughs> I've done that before. I know how hard it is. That's why I'm laughing. I, well, I won't do it again. And, and I'm famous for balloon letters, which is not what, what anybody wants. But. Hours, I'm 56 years old, <laughs> however long. I'm, I do 120 people per night at a wedding. I do two weddings yeah. a weekend. You do the math and you figure out where I am. Right? Yeah, it's in the tens of thousands of hours. And so, and, and so I uh, often, you know, a lot of artists talk to me and ask me about kind of career advice and all that. And it's kind of like the number one thing I say to them is you got to love the process. Yeah. Like the reason you want to be an artist is because you want to get up every day and go in the studio. Right. They, they see you at like an opening at a, at a gallery, which happens, you know, once or twice a year. And if it's yeah. very successful, it's like, oh, wow, this is great. This is yeah. the dream. But that that doesn't happen very often. And it's kind of like what gets you there is yeah. spending four or five hours a day every day for the rest of your life. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much, you know, in the studio, drawing, painting, working on improving the things yeah. and an entire life up to that point to develop the skills and the concepts and all that stuff. And, and it's kind of funny. People go two way, one of two ways when you tell them that. Yeah. People who who dream that they're just going to go in their studio, like they decide they want to be an artist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've yeah. never drawn or painted. And they think they can go in and just push paint around yeah. and the world will discover them. Right. Those people get very discouraged yeah, when you yeah. tell them that. Yeah. But the people who have the real passion for it and when you tell them that it, it's just about hard work,